welcome back to class. You're watching Anime Academy. This semester, we're going to be talking about the studios that bring your favorite anime to life. I'm Marina Scully, and today's class is on Wit Studio. Wit Studio was established in June 2012 as a subsidiary of IG Port under President George Wada of Production IG. Although Wit is relatively young by animation studio standards, Wit has stood out for producing several series which have had a huge impact both among Japanese and Western audiences. Their very first project, and arguably what put them on the map internationally, was adapting the award winning Kodansha series Attack on Titan or Shingeki no Kyojin. While Attack on Titan had plenty of international potential on its own, Wit ensured its success by bringing in the now legendary duo of Tetsuro Araki and Masashi Koizuka. They had previously worked together on Guilty Crown under production IG, and they've both worked on titles that found Western success, with Araki directing the Death Note anime and Koizuka working on the key animation for the Berserk movie trilogy. Araki's over the top dramatization and excruciating cliffhangers were a perfect match for the westernized setting and tone of Attack on Titan immediately putting Wit in the spotlight. Araki and Koizuka continue to work together on other projects such as the vampire slaying Seraph at the End and Kabaneti of the Iron Fortress, which played to their strengths with stylized steampunk zombies and grindhouse cinematic action. However, Wit is anything but a one-note studio. While Araki and Koizuka run loose across the world between blockbuster international hits, Wit has produced a variety of series spanning multiple genres and artistic styles. Their projects include the feature-length drama HAL, directed by Ryotaro Makihara, the comedy set in hell with woodcut-inspired visuals in Hozuki no Reitetsu, directed by Hiro Kaburaki, and the vivid colors and smooth action of Rolling Girls, directed by Kotomi Deai. Another series to note under Wit Studio is their anime adaptation of Ancient Magus Bride, Maho Tsukai no Yome, directed by Norihiro Naganuma. This critically acclaimed magical series set in the UK has shown up everywhere from the Oriko manga chart to the New York Times manga bestsellers list. Something to look out for in Wit's production is an in-house technique called Special Effects for Living Beings, formerly known as Makeup Animation, where a team of digital artists detail characters during particularly intense close-ups. You can spot it most easily in characters' hair in Kabaneri, mostly Mumei's, and the most intense parallel hatching across the piercing eyes of characters in the new season of Attack on Titan. Or if you're more into action, you can keep an eye out for the insane airborne action courtesy of animator Arifumi Imai, whose work you may recognize from some of the most intense fights in One Punch Man. What's your favorite Wit Studio project? Let us know in the comment section below or tweet your answers to us at Current Rule with the hashtag Anime Academy. Also, let us know what studio you'd be interested in learning about next. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel to get notified whenever we upload a new episode. Don't forget to share this video to help spread the anime love, and we'll see you in our next video.